Anybody want to waste some time? Darren Aronofsky has directed several films such as Requiem for a Dream, Pi, The Wrestler, The Fountain, as well as several others. Darren puts the audience in places that the world has never seen before. In his movie, The Wrestler, he throws the audience behind the scenes in the real wrestler's life. He goes into many situations such as what he's doing for love, how he's getting by with his daughter, and how he's just picking up the part-time jobs on the side. Darren uses effects such as these in many of his movies, where the camera shoots over the shoulder of the actor. This gives a totally different perspective for the audience. In addition to shooting over the shoulder of the actor, he also gives the audience a glimpse inside the character. He uses different motion blur techniques such as these that kind of give the feel that there may be alcohol abuse or drug using and stuff like that. This is an awesome technique. As you've just witnessed in the scene from Requiem for a Dream, Darren likes to treat his audience as if they were in a theme park, kinda to put them in the uncomfortable seat, to give them the edge of what's really going on and why am I watching this. But it hasn't failed yet. Movies such as The Black Swan and Requiem for a Dream have been massive successes in the box office. Watch the way she moves. Sensual. She's not faking it. Feel my touch. Respond to it. The only person standing in your way is you. 